Tonight in Spotlight, New Jersey, the USTA Eastern. This month, the group is holding its 13th annual Camp ACE at Ramapo College in Mawa. The week-long camp is for students ages 14 to 17. Linda Mann is the Managing Director of Community Tennis Development for USTA Eastern. She is joining us by phone tonight. Welcome, Linda. Linda, are you there? I am. How are Hi, you? Hi, poor baby. I'm glad we got you back. Now, what is Camp ACE? Well, Camp ACE and ACE stands for Achieving Through Coaching and Education is our annual tennis leadership camp on a college campus, which is for high school students. We have world-class coaching every day on the tennis courts with Rodney Harmon. And Rodney is a former U.S. Olympic coach and U.S. Open quarterfinalist, and a, um, along with our team of certified pros. We also, also offer uh, a variety of education programs for the children to help prepare them for college and potential careers. So that's included in what these kids can g gain from these clinics. Tell us more about that. Well, during the camp, we also, also hold a special clinic with Rodney for our high performance juniors called High Pace. Um, that particular clinic is held three times during the week, Tuesday, Wednesday, and Thursday at Ramapo College of New Jersey. Rodney's an outstanding and highly experienced coach and can help players take their tennis game to the next level. And there's still time for them to sign up. Now, aside from Rodney, Harmon, Linda, are there any new programs or teachers at the camp this year? There are. There, we actually this year are um, highlighting three additional professional, former professional tennis players. We're uh, Katrina Adams, who is uh, a professional tennis uh, player. Leslie Allen and Ann Coger, all three will be there to work with Rodney to help the kids on, on court. In addition, we also offer a, additional educational components in social media. Uh, we're having an Arthur Ashe essay contest. We're doing a junior team tennis tournament and a quick start training for the kids. And we're also taking them to the American Museum of Finance on Wall Street. Linda, thank you very much for joining us, and I'm so glad we got you back. This sounds like a wonderful camp, Camp Ace. We appreciate your talking with us today. Linda Mann with USTA Eastern. Good luck. Thank you. You're welcome. And do come back. We also have two viewer shout-outs of the day. Last Friday, I met two big fans, Tara Williams and G. Tyler Richardson of Newark. They came over to say hi and take this photo while Dave and I were on the road at the State Fair Meadowlands. They were taking part in the Roche Family Day at the State Fair. And members of the Medina family of Islin, Middlesex County were also there for that same event. Jennifer was kind enough to send us this photo that we all took at the State Fair there at East Rutherford. The Medinas are also big fans of News 12 New Jersey. And thank you all so much for coming out when we go on the road. We have such a good time with our viewers. You are watching News 12 New Jersey. Help is on the way for some New Jersey residents in flood-prone areas. Find out next.